Hey guys, it's me Ethan, back with another video, and today we are doing another meat vlog. It is John Roethlisberger Iceberg Open, it's the third meat of the season, we're gonna smash it, we're gonna smash it, we're gonna smash it, we're gonna smash it. My bag is all packed. I've got everything in it. Just gonna get a couple snacks in it, maybe. Right now, I am getting some breakfast. I'm gonna eat some oatmeal. I don't have to go to McDonald's this time to get it, though. It is really cold out. It is negative 15 degrees. I am super cold right now. So right now, we're gonna do something really special. We are going to announce the winner of the contest in my Iron Man meat vlog. The winner was Owen. He gets 39 circles. The right answer was either 37 or 38. But 39 was the closest from Owen. Go check him out. The challenge for this meet is how many times do I go over the bar on the high bar? The winner will also get a shout out in one of my next home meets. Every day, especially before a meet, I do some visualization and I see myself doing perfect routines. Every dismount, every pass stuck and as perfect as can be. And then on the way to a meet, um, I put some pump up music in the car and that's what I'm about to do. We are finally home from my meet, which actually went pretty fast. So um, now I'm gonna do my reflection. And I did think the meet went pretty well. So last meet, I stuck all six of my dismounts. But this meet, I hit all my routines with no falls or extra swings or anything like that. So that was really good in my opinion. It, during my meet, I had some knee pains and problems that were actually really bad, but even though it hurt, I kept going because this is a meet that I wanted to do. Plus, I knew that afterward I could rest. With pain, it is sometimes what you want to do is to fight through it. But with injury, it's one thing where you don't want to just go all out. You want to rest and no matter what, just stay off it or whatever you got to do to heal it. But for me, it's not an injury. It's just bad pain. So I did it anyways. And I thought I had a pretty darn good meat. I did take down my difficulty a little bit on horse, floor, and vault. Floor and vault were because of my knees. And on horse, in my last two meets, I fell on my woo. This meet, I decided to take it out and I did end up hitting horse. So for Iron Man and Windy City Invitational, I just tried to put all the skills I could into my routines. But then for this meet, I tried to hit and be super consistent. So I didn't do as hard stuff. Every year, they gave out gifts at this meet. The first year, I got gloves. Second year, I got a hat. Third year, I got a bag. My fourth year, I got another hat. And then this year, I got socks. 
That is the end of my reflection. But wait, 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 don't leave, because there's more. Tomorrow, my teammate is bringing me and my brother back to the U of M to watch Minnesota go head to head in a battle against Michigan. And after that, I'm gonna take video from my brother Mike at his meet. I think he's gonna do really good. He's trained really hard for this meet and I think he's gonna do great. We're gonna be done vlogging for today, but tomorrow we're gonna be back for some more awesome gymnastics. surprising my brother. So that is pretty cool. College meet was pretty fun to watch. The nines and tens who qualified for event finals got to do it too. So in a couple years that will be me. My brother is right after the college meet. So let's check out my parents walking in. Stick the dismount on that subscribe button. And see you guys next time.